The United States Department of Justice, also known as the Justice Department, is the U.S. Federal Executive Department responsible for the enforcement of the law and administration of justice, equivalent to the justice or interior ministries of other countries. The department is led by the Attorney General, who is nominated by the President and confirmed by the Senate and is a member of the Cabinet. The current Attorney General is Eric Holder. History The Attorney General was initially a one-person, part-time job. It was established by the Judiciary Act of 1789, but this grew with the bureaucracy. At one time the Attorney General gave legal advice to the U.S. Congress as well as the President, but this had stopped by 1819 on account of the workload involved. In 1869, the U.S. House Committee on the Judiciary, led by Congressman William Lawrence, conducted an inquiry into the creation of a law department headed by the Attorney General and composed of the various department solicitors and United States attorneys. On February 19, 1868, Lawrence introduced a bill in Congress to create the Department of Justice. This first bill was unsuccessful, however, as Lawrence could not devote enough time to ensure its passage owing to his occupation with the impeachment of President Andrew Johnson. A second bill was introduced to Congress by Rhode Island Representative Thomas Jenks on February 25, 1870, and both the Senate and House passed the bill. President Ulysses S. Grant then signed the bill into law on June 22, 1870. The Department of Justice officially began operations on July 1, 1870. The act to establish the Department of Justice drastically increased the Attorney General's responsibilities to include the supervision of all United States attorneys, formerly under the Department of the Interior, the prosecution of all federal crimes, and the representation of the United States in all court actions, barring the use of private attorneys by the federal government. The law did create a new office, that of Solicitor General, to supervise and conduct government litigation in the Supreme Court of the United States. With the passage of the Interstate Commerce Act in 1887, the federal government began to take on some law enforcement responsibilities, with the Department of Justice tasked to carry out these duties. In 1884, control of federal prisons was transferred to the new department, from the Department of Interior. New facilities were built, including the penitentiary at Leavenworth in 1895, and a facility for women located in West Virginia, at Alderson was established in 1924. In 1933, President Franklin D. Roosevelt issued an executive order which conveyed, to the Department of Justice the responsibility for the functions of prosecuting in the courts of the United States claims and demands by, and of senses, sick against, the government of the United States, and of defending claims and demands against the government, and of supervising the work of United States attorneys, marshals, and clerks in connection therewith, now exercised by any agency or officer. Headquarters the U.S. Department of Justice building was completed in 1935 from a design by Milton Bennett Medary. Upon Medary's death in 1929, the other partners of his Philadelphia firm Zantzinger, Borey and Medary took over the project. On a lot bordered by Constitution and Pennsylvania Avenues and 9th and 10th Streets, Northwest, it holds over one million square feet of space. The sculptor C. Paul Genwine served as overall design consultant for the entire building, contributing more than 50 separate sculptural elements inside and outside. Various efforts, none entirely successful, have been made to determine the meaning of the Latin motto appearing on the Department of Justice seal, Qui pro domina justicia sequitur. It is not even known exactly when the original version of the DOJ seal itself was adopted, or when the motto first appeared on the seal. The most authoritative opinion of the DOJ suggests that the motto refers to the Attorney General, who prosecutes on behalf of justice. The building was renamed in honor of former Attorney General Robert F. Kennedy in 2001. It is sometimes referred to as Main Justice. Organization Leadership Offices Office of the Attorney General Office of the Deputy Attorney General Office of the Associate Attorney General Office of the Solicitor General Divisions Antitrust Division, Civil Division, Civil Rights Division, Criminal Division, Environment and Natural Resources Division, Justice Management Division, National Security Division, Tax Division, War Division, 
law enforcement agencies, several federal law enforcement agencies are administered by the Department of Justice, United States Marshal Service, Federal Bureau of Investigation, Federal Bureau of Prisons, National Institute of Corrections, Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives, Drug Enforcement Administration, Office of the Inspector General, Offices, Executive Office for Immigration Review, Executive Office for U.S. Attorneys, Executive Office of the United States Trustee, Office of Attorney Recruitment and Management, Office of the Chief Information Officer. In May 2014, the department appointed Joseph Klimovic as CIO. Klimovic succeeds Kevin Dealey, who served as acting CIO since November 2013 when the previous office holder, Luke McCormack, left to take the CIO post at the Department of Homeland Security. Office of Dispute Resolution, Office of the Federal Detention Trustee, Office of Immigration Litigation, Office of Information Policy, Office of Intelligence Policy and Review, Office of Intergovernmental and Public Liaison, Office of Justice Programs, Bureau of Justice Assistance, Bureau of Justice Statistics, Community Capacity Development Office, National Institute of Justice. Office of Juvenile Justice and Delinquency Prevention, Sex Offender Sentencing, Monitoring, Apprehending, Registering, and Tracking Office, Office for Victims of Crime, Office of the Police Corps and Law Enforcement Education, Office of Legal Counsel, Office of Legal Policy, Office of Legislative Affairs, Office of the Pardon Attorney, Office of Privacy and Civil Liberties, Office of Professional Responsibility, Office of Public Affairs. Office on Sexual Violence and Crimes Against Children, Office of Tribal Justice, Office on Violence Against Women, Professional Responsibility Advisory Office, United States Attorney's Offices, United States Trustee's Offices, Office of Community Oriented Policing Services, Community Relations Service, Other Offices and Programs, Foreign Claims Settlement Commission of the United States, Interpol, U.S. National Central Bureau National Drug Intelligence Center, Obscenity Prosecution Task Force, United States Parole Commission. In March 2003, the United States Immigration and Naturalization Service was abolished and its functions transferred to the United States Department of Homeland Security. The Executive Office for Immigration Review and the Board of Immigration Appeals, which review decisions made by government officials under immigration and nationality law, remain under jurisdiction of the Department of Justice. Similarly the Office of Domestic Preparedness left the Justice Department for the Department of Homeland Security, but only for executive purposes. The Office of Domestic Preparedness is still centralized within the Department of Justice, since its personnel are still officially employed within the Department of Justice. In 2003, the Department of Justice created lifeandliberty.gov a website that supported the Patriot Act. It was criticized by government watchdog groups. Finances and Budget The Justice Department was authorized a budget for fiscal year 2015 of approximately $21 billion. The budget authorization is broken down as follows. See also Notes and references External links Official website, USDOJ in the Federal Register, Organization Chart U.S. DOJ Documents Post 9-11 Memos, OIG Reports Four torture memos released April 16, 2009 in response to FOIA suit by ACLU. Human Rights First In Pursuit of Justice, Prosecuting Terrorism Cases in the Federal Courts, Justice.gov Indictment Against Internet Poker Using UIGA United States Department of Justice collected news and commentary at the Washington Post.